This time we're checking out a cool trick that you can do with a random. You can make a sub oscillator out of your oscillators. So I got a patch here. It's basically a saw, a saw wave, uh, just getting CV, triggering an envelope, going into VCA and a speaker. Nothing special, but pretty cool still. If you notice anything weird, it might be this. Uh, a handy trick that you can do is use the LFO square to the clock in on the sequencer and turn the LFO really low. That triggers the sequencer slower than the regular clock, allows it to go. So that's a tip for you, a bonus tip. Now, back to sub oscillationing. We're going to use the random, as I said. So we're going to listen to our output just for fun and we're gonna take the out second output of the saw connect that to the input on ram random i'm gonna connect a random module to our mixer because we have our saw going into this mixer so now if we raise up dial number three, we'll get this beefy little sub oscillator, a gritty little sub oscillator. If you listen only to it, this is just the sub oscillator, the random module spitting out. It's chopping up the saw signal, and then you pitch it, tune it, whatever you want to call it, with the rate knob. So it fits with the original. It's, it's not perfect, it's pretty hard to tune as well. But, listen to this, if I take the sub out now... It's really thin and you miss it. So it does add a lot of stuff to the signal. That's it. Use it in your patches, have fun, experiment. Take care.